Hello class, today I'll be telling you how to add bullets and numbering for your notes, for example, science notes, and how to, how to improve your paragraph structure. First of all, you open Microsoft Word. Then, you go to Format, and then you go to Bullets and Numbering. Now there are different types of bullet bullets and numbering. There are the bulleted ones, the numbered ones, the outline numbered ones. Now these ones are for like hit out like really specific outlines. You guys don't really need it because beginners don't really need this unless you're a big businessman or you're a student that needs to learn how to do have the right outline format. So I'll be showing you how to do bullet and numbering. You can also customize it, but you don't really need to because it's really specific. It's not that bad, like from here too. So okay, so I'll use this one. Okay, now you you see there's a bullet, right? So you all right, hello. Then the next will automatically come as a bullet. Oh, like hi so you know that it's number one number two number three it's like it, you're listing out stuff I'll go there again okay I'll use I'll use numbers numbering now okay so I'll use one two three so one so you don't have to put one and then you have to type out one and then if you bull if you use this bullet numbering you can have the exact size and the exact format. So number one, I like soccer. Number two, it just comes out number two automatically. I like curry. Number three. I want I want to go to India. So it automatically com automatically comes out. So you know and it's in right order. It's chron it's chron chronological and it's lined up well. That's pretty much it. Or else I, I can also show you the other one, the out outline number one. It's really specific. So, okay, so I'll do my topic sentence will be soccer is a great sport. And then, okay, I'm sorry, that's the same thing, but I mean, you really don't need the bullets and numbering because it's really specific. And, yep, that's pretty much it for bullets and numbering. Now, I'll show you the paragraphing. Now, your teachers ask you, your teachers or your boss might ask you to double space and write a one page story or something. And you guys don't, some people don't know how to do it. So, to double space it, you just have to click on line spacing right over here. And then you just click on double space. Everything else is just in order, so you really, really don't need to fix that. And then, now if I write something, automatically double space. I write something, automatically double space. If you want to indent it, there's a tab button on the way left, and I I suggest you to adjust, adjust it to 0 0.25. But if you want to indent it more, then you can do 0 0.5, 0 or something, but it'll be really far away, so 0 0.25 is better. And then you just press the tab button. It automatically puts it I mean, and that's it and that's pretty much it thank you for watching see you later